Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the last day in M I A M I. Doesn't sound as good if you don't sing it. M I A M I. My cast back. Anyway, last day in Miami. This is it. We're saying goodbye. We're packing up. We were supposed to be at this hotel room uh, about seven minutes ago, but don't worry about it. I left the door open as if it looks like we're leaving, so they ain't gonna kick us out. But no, for real, this hotel has been awesome. Shower, bath, you get 100 points out of 10 because that was so much fun yesterday with all the bubbles. It's been a lovely hotel, on it? Oh, <laughs> Lydia's totally not struggling trying to close the suitcase. Just gonna leave you to that and just keep on moving. Um, I accidentally knocked over a bunch of these and it's a pressure censored uh, thing, so I'm probably gonna have to check the bill and be like, no, I didn't pay for that. Uh, as well, at the same time as I put my beers, my Blue Moon beers, in the back of there and then took them out. So I'm gonna have to go over the bill meticulously because they're gonna probably charge me like five thousand dollars for uh, not even touching anything. Technically, I did touch it, but I didn't drink it or I didn't eat it. So yeah, it could be quite sad to leave the uh, the F Fontaine. I think it's called the Fontaine Blue, not Fountain Blue. I'll meet I'll meet you halfway. The Fontaine Blue, but everyone's lazy and calls this place the Fountain Blue. Uneducated fools, what do you even think about? Idiots, <laughs> disrespectful. But no, yeah, hotel, I'd give the room a, I give it a solid like 8.5 out of 10. Yeah. yeah. As, it would be nice if the ice machine was working, the AC was the incredible. Yeah, if the cold tap actually worked, it was always just like, you know, like that. It eight. was it was that really lukewarm. What, what, because you don't have a cold tap, you dropping it down even more? Yeah. Damn, son. Do you know what was the best she thing? She's savage. What was the best thing about this hotel? Club live. Club live. Oh man, yeah. That club live, man. Whoa, so lit, man. Did you not see us last night? We partied so hard, we passed out. Like, whoa. Uh, yeah, everyone hyped it up, being like, you have to go. It's the place to go. Club live. Club live. Club live. And did we go? No, we didn't. I went to club. Leave me alone. I'm going to sleep. Oh. Okay, um, it is clearly checkout day. Ah, oh, our lovely hotel has returned to a non-sketchy ghetto-ass vacation spot. Lydia's seen this and wants to go for dim sum. Could you really eat dim sum like that? <laughs> Favourite thing about this holiday, go. Bubble bath. It was pretty spectacular, wasn't it? It was pretty goddamn spectacular. There's always that defining moment of a day when you're like, this has been a great day. And I thought it was the cruise ship. The cruise ship, but I was like, mother of God. If you've seen uh, Detective Pikachu, when the mountains start moving, that's what it felt like. I was like, the world is moving around me. What is going on? But then the bubble bath, oh my God. <laughs> you're so good on it. You're so cute. I like but the no. helicopter tour as well. Helicopter tour was good. Um, I'm not as good as the bubble bath. No, I think the bubble bath is definitely... What did you do in Florida? Bubble bath. It was the most defining moment we could ever have done. It was the greatest thing ever. But we checked out the hotel now. Uh, we've got our bag stored. We do have... Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Has it been a bad day of food yet? Yeah. The Italian, but that was breakfast. And we had it at 3 o'clock. And it, it wasn't, wasn't bad. bad. It we was were just, just not... We were past it the stage the of hunger. Kind of yeah, we should have had it. Yeah, we had all those Italians we could have choose from and then we got to another Italian and you said, let's have an Italian. What was the other time? Oh, my toast. And for our last meal, our breakfast in America, with me with my pink eye. Um, <laughs> I was going to say, it, Ryan, do you want to do like a Sauron edit where it's like, get the Tower of Sauron and my eye looking like this. If you can do something with that, Ryan, you're a wizard. <laughs> He's like... Hate my job. It was like Tom. I'm supposed to be an editor, not a masterful wizard VFX guy. But I would, I would make you one, Ryan. We will become the greatest team ever. I'll just give you the weirdest tasks, and together we'll achieve everything. But for our final meal, Lydia has got Nutella on toast and Cheerios, and I have got. I've, hey, I've changed things up today. I got toast. I got strawberry jam. I didn't change anything. Stick to what you know. <laughs> what? <laughs> Didn't do that. That can't be worse than the monster energy. Oh, all right then. Shots fired. Cheers, babe. There goes my sponsorship. 
Hi, uh, Monster Energy. Lydia would love to take back what she said. She says, give Tom sponsorship so he can go skydiving, do loads of stunts and bikes and stuff like that all day, every day, all day, every day. Thank you. Is it that right? No, it kills you. <laughs> Same. Bloody hell. Is it just me or is it the brightest it's ever been? God damn it, it's bright. And thus, the perfect way to spend the last day in Miami, the beach. Is what I'm talking about. Yes, please. Oh. No, no, no. <laughs> By the time this vlog goes live, the advertisement will stop. But if we, and Ryan, can we can we edit a thank you onto that for uh, to everyone who purchased themselves a Syndicate Regional shirt? The final bit of promotion, a thank you to all those who've supported us. And I can stop the promotion. Because by the time this vlog went live, it's that'll late. be it. It's too late. Oh, oh wait, wait a minute. Wait, that's not promoting Syndicate Regional. That's promoting twitch.tv forward slash Cal. Oh my God, look at that. Cal's budget's gone right up. Guys, if you want to follow Cal on Twitch, go to twitch.tv forward slash Cal, click that follow button, and you'll be able to watch him live stream. Brilliant. I knew he was killing it, but I didn't know he was going to go so far as to photobomb my vlog. The Twitch.tv forward slash Cal. <laughs> you little Hello, madam, and welcome to Tom's Coral Shop. May I interest you in my words? I can offer you one piece of coral, two piece of coral, <laughs> half a shell, little shell, kind of shell, not a clue, little bit cement, <laughs> uh, shell, dirty shell, clean shell, top of the line shell, and baby shell. Oh, my lady, which one would you like? $5,000. What do you mean? What does that look for? I, I no shell. I bring the premium waste from the ocean. I go in there, I collect, I bring back. No shell? That is so shellfish. <laughs> we did actually bring the uh, waterproof thing for the, the, the going in the ocean so I could take my phone in, you know, and not break it. But then I was just like, I really can't be bothered taking it in. I'm not being rude, but I was just like, I just want to swim around like a potato little shark. And that's exactly what we did. But now, unfortunately, the time has come, Lid. The time has come, but... Oh, we saw a stingray. Yeah, and I chased after it. And I was like, Lydia, come catch. And she like swam for like 300 meters to catch up with me. And then she missed it. Oh, no, you saw it, didn't oh, you? I saw it. It was cool though, wasn't it? Yeah, it was quite big. exactly the same color as the sand. Yeah, it went like this, yeah. blended in. And I went over to it and went, boop. I didn't poke it. I got close. And then he was like, what are you doing like? Swam off and went. <laughs> you missed the fish. I don't care about no fish. It's not a stingray. The beach has been so much better today though. Because like all the, what's it called? Fishy seaweed. Seaweed. <laughs> All the seaweed had gone and it's all like crumbled up into like a dust here But the ocean is so much lower today because look at this sandbar that wasn't here on the first day So you can like go all the way out there and just stand up like look people have stood up all the way out there So that's where we were and that's where we saw a stingray It was really cool and then that dark blue is where it gets super deep and then I got a bit scared of sharks So I turned around because I'm a wimp. I'm not scared scared of the ocean It's just you know where you're in shark water shark territory. I don't care if someone goes well, it's not common, it's not this, it's... I don't care, they're still there, all right? It's still a chance. I'd rather keep my, my toes. Thank you. I'm making Lydia walk around with all the stuff because the floor is so hot, I'm literally burning my feet. So I thought, you know what? Rather than walking around the pool, I'm gonna go through the pool to the other side and get a bit of a swimming. <laughs> Look at her. She's stuck walking. She's stuck walking around there. And I get to scoot across. <laughs> Genius. L Lydia, the Uber's here. <laughs> oh yeah, we got the Farizzles, the Farizzi Rarees. Okay, we should just be able to get our bags now. Once we've got our bags. Oh, what? How did we not know this was here on the first day? Oh, what? Oh, okay. Th Whoa, $1,500 to rent a Ferrari for a day. Holy bloody. Whoa, three grand a day. Jesus. Quickly making the most of this like little uh, vanity room where you can come here, you can get changed, get a little locker and all that sort of stuff, you get a shower. So you know like say your flight like us is at 5pm, rather than uh, you like shout like going by the pool, getting all sandy and all that sort of stuff by the beach and then be like right going to the airport full of stickiness and sun cream and all that. You can come into these like vanity rooms, like a refresher room, get shower, get changed, locker, get, get everything you need to get organised and then get rock and rolling feeling fresh. So that's what we're doing and then we're going to the airport, it's currently <laughs> Uh, half past two right now. Flight is at five, so two and a half hours. Should take us 30 minutes to get to the airport. Should be perfectly on time. Ish. And I think I can say, even though, yeah, I'm a little bit red, I think I've got a cracking tan from this holiday. <laughs> <laughs> Good success. All right. 
Ready to rock and roll? Miami has been absolutely amazing. Honestly, I've had such a good time. Look at that tan. God damn. Bang, 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 bang. Looking good. The thing is, if you think like my adventure like ends here and it's like, oh no, back to England, that's it, we're in the rain again. No, I get back to England, okay? I have, wait, what time do we even land? Like maybe 6 p.m. I get to sleep from 6 p.m. till like one o'clock in the morning that day I land, because then Tuesday at 3 a.m. I'm going on a stag do for four days in Ibiza. So yeah, you've seen pretty, mediocre Tom on this sort of holiday, you know, relaxing with Lydia, whereas I'm about to go to stag do and things are gonna get a little bit wild. So, uh, wish me luck. But I am uh, kind of happy that <laughs> all my mates are probably gonna be pale, except Wes, because, you know, like, he's, he's, you know, he's just naturally brown. Uh, but yeah, all my friends are gonna be like, pale white, and then there's me gonna be all tanned up and burnt like a lobster. All right, there it is. Amazing stay at the hotel. You ready to rock and roll? Ooh, thank you, sir. Yeah, wearing all black is not the best of idea, Poor but it pants won't. Yeah. And a jumper. Hopefully, it shouldn't matter when we get to the airport. That's all I'm Ooh, saying. How blonde I am. I want to say like, oh, I'm so brown, but then I'm compared to you. I got freckles. Do you know as soon as we land, we'll be white anyway. England zaps it out of you. <laughs> I'm going to Ibiza. Whoa, Ibiza. to the Mediterranean Sea. Can we eat? Any, uh, you guys got any spare room for two, please? Let us on. That was the one we saw yesterday. Huh? You're the... Oh no, you're good, you're good, thank you. <laughs> Let's get to the airport, not miss the flight, yeah? And thus we are saying goodbye to Miami. It was amazing, I loved it. I will return, I will be back. Till next time. <laughs> excuse me ma'am, excuse me ma'am, what is that in your bag? I just gently closed my liquids back. Excuse me ma'am, what is that? Is that... It's a water snake. Is that a water snake? Ma'am, you're gonna have to leave your water snake behind. Ma'am, that is a dangerous item and could be considered a threat on the plane. And this will be the last of the Miami heat. Let's get us to Terminal D. Grand Cayman, 3.30 departure. Come on, let's go. We're so f close, man. All right, let's look for London Heathrow, British Airways. Not that flight though, because, uh, is it? Nah, no, 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 no. We got a five o'clock flight. Well, that's an annoying advertisement in your way of trying to read things, but okay. London Heathrow, 505. I think, yeah, British Airways, 206. Yep, gate E24, sweet. Lydia actually taught me a pro travel trip. Okay, so you know I don't like checking in my bag, but I always have to go in my bag to get like my liquids out, you know, because that's where I keep them in there so they don't leak into this one. Well, pro tip, if you actually just keep this bag inside there or, you know, inside an actual travel like wash bag, all you have to do is throw that through the security and don't have to mess with it in the slightest like no one zipping it and moving it and all that sort of stuff and all you've got to do is when you open this up to get your laptop out just take that bag out and you're done smart i learned something i know it sounds really obvious but i never used to keep any liquids in this bag whatsoever just you know in case it like ruins like my gopro or my laptop or something like that but gopro's waterproof but you know what i mean but she's actually got a pretty it's a pretty smart way of doing things as bad decisions go this is a really bad decision. Oh, there's a KFC as well. Oh, there's a Starbucks, yay. Uh, okay, so listen, as bad decisions go, having a Taco Bell, we're probably gonna shit ourselves on the plane because it goes through me like water. I oh, know, sorry, too much information. But Lydia's never had it before and I've not had it in the longest time. So we're gonna have Taco Bell, okay? Oh. Let's do it. And if that wasn't bad enough for you, I popped to KFC because Lydia's never had a KFC famous bowl, which I don't know if we have in the UK, but they're amazing. It's basically mashed potatoes, cheese, gravy, and chicken pieces in a bowl of just heaven. So I'm getting one of them as well. All right, Lydia's gonna eat the uh, <laughs> the Doritos taco. How good is that? <laughs> so good. I think that's the. I think that might be the Cool Ranch one. I could, oh wait, I could be wrong. Nope, that's the Doritos Less Tacos. So that's the cool one. And that's the cheesy one, cheesy one yeah. 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 This is the fiery one. Oh, 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 oh. Rip my flight. Mmm. Mmm. That good in it. Not spicy that no. Oh. Mate. I know it's bad for me, but that is the best taco I've ever had in my life. <laughs> I've had so much Mexican food. Where everyone in LA is like, it's the best Mexican food in LA, right? I'm like, Taco Bell's better. My favorite thing from KFC in all of America, okay? It's called a famous bowl. 
chicken cheese sweet corn what? mashed potato and gravy what put it there you've got gravy in there I don't know. yeah right mm. how good is that oh mixed reactions maybe wait i haven't tried it yet hey, it's popcorn, popcorn chicken, chicken and mash, and mash. Wait. Mm. i love it i love it mm-hmm Mm hmm So overall, your favourite one was the uh, the orange Dorito one, yeah. but not the spicy the one. one. But did you prefer the KFC Famous Bowl over all of it? Fuck it, I knew it! I knew you're too it good! So How far do you feel now? I feel like I'm gonna give birth. I feel like I'm gonna give birth. Oh, Mate. I had a lot of food babies There it is. Margarita Bill. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> do, do. Do, 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 do. Why are you biting my ass? What the heck is that? <laughs> oh, she's sad to leave. But here's our big boy. I'm pretty sure this is our plane. Hello, mister. How are you doing, lad? I don't think we're going to be as lucky today. I don't think we're going to be as lucky today. Mate, these people are absolute crazy It's Like, is it really necessary for you all to stand up at once? No, it's not even open yet. You fools, sit down. They'll tell you when to board. What's going to happen? Someone's going to steal your seat? No. And then there was us. I hate this though. Whoa! You wait for ages and you're like, yeah, I've missed the queue. And but then there's still a queue. You get to the little. Yeah. What's the, it called? The walkway, yeah. yeah. And they're still queuing. We're coming! Hold the plane! One small step for man, one giant step for Tom's vlog. So, how do you feel after your Taco Bell? I also feel. It, yeah, it tastes so good at the start, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah, it's there. It just doesn't go down, does it? It's just so, it's so not good for you, but it's so good for you. Keep trying to drink water. And it doesn't, it just sits on top of the food, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah, like, I'm going to be sick. Goodbye. Yeah, oh yeah, this is what Lydia means. Like, you go through security, they rush you, and you just get stuck here. But goodbye, Miami. It was real. I loved you. Bye-bye. All right. Another cozy little flight, and unfortunately, no bug sockets to charge your stuff on, so good luck with your battery and another tiny little screen. <laughs> yeah, but they're both mine. I'm joking, I will share. Miami was a success. Do you know what? I've got one thing I forgot to take off my pink eye. She farted one night in bed so bad that I almost thought I was going to throw up. And then it was all in this. Nice. She's laughing because she knows it's true. Look how bad it is. Look into my soul, right eye. I'm not scratching it. I'm purposely not scratching it. So, we may be complaining about the size of the screen being a little tiny because we're clearly on like a much, much older plane. But we've only got seven hours to go and the Lego Movie 2's on it, which I've not seen yet. So, great success. 45 minutes in tour in London. Oh, I wasn't going to see much out of that window, was I? There's a wing in the way. All right. Oh. Oh, look who it is! <laughs> All right, London, London, London. How is the weather looking? Pretty goddamn nice. I like it. I am actually going to end this vlog very shortly because it's the end of yesterday's day, okay, this day, and therefore I have to start tomorrow's vlog. Bye bye. Thank you. Thank you very much. How the hell did she beat me off the plane? You. How did you beat me? You just got specialist treatment. <laughs> All right, how are you feeling? It's currently, right now, 1 a.m. in Miami, but 6 a.m. in England, and we didn't, maybe, sleep. no? no yeah, neither did I. No sleep at all on the plane. <laughs> I just got completely distracted by that thing. Jesus, what a mammoth. <sighs> anyway, so yeah, didn't sleep on a plane, unfortunately, which is a bit of a, a bummer because if we would have slept on the plane I'd have been feeling fresh as anything right now I'm ready to start a new day but I haven't slept like at all my eye the pink eye is getting worse it, by the way it's not actually pink eye I've, I've actually scratched my eyes a bit cut on it I don't know how I did it but more importantly I have got today to get my together because tomorrow morning at 3am 
I'm getting up and flying off to Ibiza with the homies for a stag day. It's gonna be a struggle. It seems we have a gamer on the bus. I spot that League of Legends backpack and that Minecraft pickaxe. Ah yes, no surprise, Lydia's bag got stuck. Great. I'm gonna take this opportunity after getting back off holiday. Which I'm aware makes no sense. Um, yeah, I went on holiday to, uh, to Miami for all that time. No sunglasses whatsoever. Constantly in the sun like this. To then come to England and then go, hmm. Maybe I should try and find some. Perfect. Da 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 Breakfast time at the Fortman Mason bar. Of which I'm gonna take this moment to end today's vlog. Oh Olivia. yeah! Great holiday. Mm, a nose kiss. Great holiday. We're exhausted. I've got another adventure in less, well, in 20, no, 20, in about 20 hours. I'm gonna be on another adventure. It's been pretty non-stop for me the past like two, three months or something like that. But guys, honestly, I can't thank you all enough for tuning in and watching the vlogs. It's been amazing. Seeing your guys' feedback has been in incredible. And to everyone who's this is like, you won't hear me going on about it again and again and again. But everyone who supported the limited edition shirt, thank you so much. Because now it's done, it's over. The sale has ended. It's uh, one of my favorite ones. I can't, ones wait, as well. like, I can't so wait for you guys to get the design. It's gorgeous, especially the limited edition version. It's, so 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 beautiful i can't wait for you guys to get your hands on it but i need to end today's vlog uh when the orders start going out hopefully you'll see me vlogging it and uh, sharing it with you guys because uh you know we do a pre-order period then we uh distribute them all and you'll see syndicate original just absolutely stressing because there's so many orders to take care of but uh, again thank you so much as a family-run company it means a lot to me but i'm going uh the next few days are going to contain a lot of debauchery of drinking and idiocy with me and my homies on a stag do because he's getting married and ruining his life so we need to send him off in style Oh, I'm not getting married. Yeah, no, 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 got no. married though. And uh, I'm probably going to come back with a pink eye on this eye because someone's going to fart on my pillow in the night. I don't trust anyone on that holiday. I think I might take a shaver with me and shave my friend's eyebrows off. In good news, my water snake got through customs. If you haven't been watching the vlog and you have no context as to what water snake is, I'm just going to leave you on that one. But guys, thank you for watching. Make sure you leave a like button. Click that subscribe button, ding on the notification bell, and I'll see you guys tomorrow at 6 p.m. for the next day vlog. So until then, much love. Missa, dude. Oh, I'm sorry.